Hi viewers, welcome to Pen of Jordan. In this video, we are going to see a short review on Can Write Blaze Fountain Pen, and this video is specially uh, taken to give the clear insight on the pen because just with photos, you can't understand full details about this. So, here I'm going to show all the details. Like, yeah, this pen has a silver trim, uh, trim portion, and which their brand's name is Can Write was engraved, and a long ring uh, on the cap. And here, there is a window in which you can find the inks level in this pen and the brand's name can it also uh, stamped in this uh, body and this is a thread type mechanism you have to unscrew the cap to open this and this is number four nib and yeah this is a short grip portion and yeah i'm going to show the measurements here The diameter of the grip portion is 8.9 mm and the, the reservoir and the body of this, the diameter of the body is 11.5 mm and the total length of this pen without the cap is 119.7 mm. With cap, this comes around 132.8 mm. The length of this cap, uh, the entire weight of this pen is 16 grams. Yeah. This is an eyedropper fountain pen and here there is a breather hole in this cap in this uh, hole uh, in this cap which is which prevents the ink from blogging and it maintains a balanced atmospheric pressure so that ink does not leak or burp ink through the nips and as this the holding part is holding diameter is a smaller one a thinner one this is more suitable for uh, little fingers for little children and also please note this is a, here this is a transparent part so don't use primary color ink so that uh, the it will create a strain on the wall of the uh, pen and also the important thing in a eye drop of fountain pen is the maintenance please wash the pen at least once uh, uh, once or twice a week because uh, in the month uh, because all the dye based ink will precipitate on longer usage so it will block the ink's passage in the feeder so you need to uh, Clean the pen with water, uh, otherwise you will get a scratchy writing inside and it will uh, slowly the ink will dry quickly then you may have to shake the pens for the ink flow to come out and for this you can hold this uh, nib set means you can hold this feeder uh, part and twist and pull this out. So this is an easy way to remove this one and for that you can use any cloths. You have to hold uh, this and tightly you have to turn this and pull this out this you have to do this in simultaneously and this is come out easily from the grip area and this is a simple two minutes process this and flush the feeder with the help of toothbrush or any brush to clean uh, this part and clean well with soap water or in tap water if you are soaking in soap water then allow it for an hour and uh, brush and clean and in the ink bottle itself you can notice on every fill it is recommended to clean the pen with water and here I'm giving the sample for that yeah this is a brill ink and here it is given clean the pen with water uh, before filling with brill ink yeah so it is clear unless otherwise we have good maintenance and good cleaning uh, the pen will affect it so yeah again on maintenance all the threads are turned to one out so uh, apply a silicone grease or vaseline on every fill 
whenever you're opening and closing the pen and the grip area apply silicon grease and this will increase the life of the thread and also whenever you fill the ink fill below the inner threads so if you fill in excess it will lead to the leakage path so you will spoil your hands and also few nibs need to be fine tuned and because during manual assembly of nibs the tines may stick together so gently push the tines up and down like this you have to do this with your nails or with any other uh, uh, small knives too and make sure the tines are uh, the tines are in parallel if not you will get a scratchy writing and whenever we dispatch this pen to our customer we do this fine tuning and we will we'll check the uh, uh, all details about this before dispatching here i'm going to give the writing sample of this pen for that i'm using our penhouse emerald green ink Yeah, this is so smooth. Yeah, this is a normal work house pen which uh, which can hold a, a good amount of ink in this. So, actually, this is mainly a uh, very good pen for the little uh, school going children who can uh, use this with a good capability of ink too and the writing was so good and if you have any query about this pen you can ask in the comment section or else you can make a call to our number thanks for watching this video